Wheel Alignment Overview Wheel alignment is the proper adjustment of all interrelated suspension angles. When done correctly, drivers will get the best overall handling and tire performance possible. The most common type of wheel alignments performed today include thrust, four-wheel, and two-wheel alignment. Thrust alignment is where the front wheels are aligned to the rear axle. The drive direction of the rear axle is referred to as the thrust angle. The thrust angle and geometric center should be the same. Four-wheel alignment is when all four wheels are independently aligned to the geometric center line. Two-wheel alignments align only the front wheels to the vehicle center line and assume the rear wheels are aligned with the geometric center line. For light-duty trucks, wheel alignment is typically standard two-wheel or thrust alignment because they are usually full frame with a non-independent driving rear axle. Before beginning alignment procedures, be sure to perform a thorough inspection of the steering and suspension system. Inspection of the rear suspension on light-duty trucks is critical. Component wear can be significantly increased due to loading and unloading. Whether a light-duty truck or passenger car, make sure that the alignment angles are correct to ensure good handling and reduce tire wear. The alignment angles needed to be set on any vehicle, passenger or light truck include camber, caster, and tow. Camber is the degree of tilt of the wheel measured at the top. A wheel tilted in towards the engine is negative. Tilted out is positive. Correct wheel camber improves tire life enhances stability and reduces stress on other suspension parts. Caster is a line drawn through the steering axis and then compared to vertical. If the axis is tilted back at the top, the angle is positive. Tilted forward is negative. Caster improves stability, steering wheel return and cornering. Toe is an angle formed by a line drawn through the horizontal center of each wheel relative to the center line of the vehicle. Correct toe angle in or out will reduce scuff and improve tire life by reducing running toe to an average near zero. Other parameters to check for correct wheel alignment include chassis height, steering axis inclination, included angle, and turning radius. Chassis height is the foundation of camber, caster, and toe. If out of specification, angles can be set, but dynamic running angles will not be in range. If chassis height is out of specification, it can contribute to poor handling and tire wear. Steering axis inclination helps the wheels return to the straight ahead position, increases stability requiring less caster angle, and improves stability under braking conditions. Turning radius is also known as toe out on turns. When the vehicle is steered into a turn, the steering arms cause the wheels to turn at different angles, creating a toe-out condition. If both wheels turned at the same angle, the outside wheel would scuff excessively because its turning radius should be greater. Once you've determined which angle is out of alignment and the corrective actions to take, you will need to begin your wheel adjustment procedure. Wheel adjustment procedures are different for most vehicles. There are a variety of adjustment mechanisms, including shims, cams, threaded rods, and slotted frame. Refer to the appropriate vehicle service manual for specific procedures. <laughs>